so friends let us start the third part of this chapter land soil water vegetation and wildlife so as you know in the last chapter we done soil part but the one thing which was left in the last part that one is the distribution of soil in india different different types of soils are found here in india let us understand one by one the each part of the soil first is the alluvial soil before that let me clear in which part of the india alluvial soil is found so in this part of india alluvial soil is found basically so widely spread soil deposited by himalayan rivers let us come to the second type of soil mountain soil also known as forest soil because a lot of forests are found here this type of soil is found in the hilly region of india it is various according to the mountain of the environment it is found as you can see here the mountain ranges of india this type of soil is found so basically here this type of soil is found now let us come to the another type of soil and this another type of soil is the black soil this black soil is also known as ragged soil igneous rock is its parents rock its uh, roots keep the wetness of water and that is why this soil is too much suitable for the production of cotton this type of soil is basically found in here you can see in the deccan trap part of india this type of soil is found now let us come to the another soil red and yellow soil when it is wet it look red in color while when it is dry it look yellow in colors and this is just because of the iron contents which is found in this soil this soil is basically found in all these regions of india now let us come to the next type of soil which is a laterite soil high temperature heavy rainfall is found in this regions this soil is less fertile soil as we already discussed in last part that when rains comes from the arabian sea and the branch of bay of bengal because of the high rainfall this part is getting a high rainfall and because of this high rainfall the soil lost its fertility the water take whole minerals and for nutrition of this soil with it and drain in the ribbon sea and bay of bengal and that is why now this soil is a no use of soil but this soil is 
hard when it is dry and when it is wet it is very chip chipa type so this one is very good for making bricks and already already the meaning of the letter it is a brick it's a latin word now let us come to the dry region this is a here the dry soil is found again this soil is divided into two parts this is arid while this is the semi arid region of the soil here you can see aravalli mountains are found so it is in the west of the aravalli mountains in semi arid regions Side type of soil is found, but it's a plain region. While the arid region is totally sand dune area. These sand dunes are known as barchans in this in the local languages. As I said, that it is divided into two parts: arid and semi-arid. In semi-arid, millets cultivation of millets are there. These regions get less than 150 mm or 15 cm rainfall so that's all in this part of the chapter any kind of problems and doubt you can call to me my blog is bipin dogra.blogspot.in visit it thank you